the more targeted the market, the easier it is to reach those people that are potential subscribers. And by the way, the more targeted the market and the more niche the market, the easier it is to find those people online and the more likely they are to subscribe to your newsletter. Welcome back to Making Money with AI. I'm Dave Espino, and if you wanna learn the best ways to make money using AI, then you've come to the right place. I'm inviting you to get your free AI newsletter at the link below. I've been making money online for 25 years, and I'd like to be your coach and help you make money with AI too. Okay, let's get into today's video. Welcome back to Making Money with AI, and this is part of a several part series talking about ways to make money with AI with content and information products. So we already covered uh, creating a YouTube channel like I have here. We also talked about blogs and websites, the difference between those and how you can make money with AI reporting on the world of AI. Today, I wanna talk about newsletters around AI. Now the newsletter business is a very lucrative business. I happen to have an AI newsletter and while I offer a free newsletter, and that'll be in the link in the description below, I also offer a paid newsletter. And that's where you can make some really good money because over time you keep accumulating and accumulating subscribers to your paid newsletter. And so your income keeps growing. And the beautiful thing about a newsletter is it's recurring income. If you wanna stay on top of the latest AI news and videos showing you the best ways to make money using AI, you should sign up for Dave's free Making Money with AI newsletter at the link in the description below. And when you sign up for Dave's free newsletter, you'll also receive a free ebook, 40 Ways to Make Money with ChatGPT as a thank you gift. These are Dave's free gifts and you're invited to get yours in the link in the description below. And that's really important, especially because in most other businesses, you don't have recurring income. However, when you do have recurring income, especially a newsletter business, uh, is very, very valuable as a business that you can sell. So this is the big distinction between uh, the other businesses that I'm talking about in this series and the newsletter business that I'm talking about today. The newsletter business there's been quite a few high profile newsletters sold recently, newsletter businesses that have grown very fast. And then the founders exited for millions of dollars. And the reason is that recurring income, that subscription income that is hard to get in many other businesses. But when you have a lot of people paying you $19 a month, $25 a month, $47 a month, $97 a month, et cetera, for your newsletter, that is a viable business that you can then sell at some point. You can exit out of that business. Whereas if you have a business where you kind of have one-time sales, one-time course sale here, one-time course sale there, one-time supplement sale, one-time product sale, et cetera, it's harder to sell that business because the income is not as consistent as predictable. So having said that, you want to take a good look at the newsletter business. In fact, I'm going to be coming out with a course really soon with my uh, friend, Jeremy. Both of us have started newsletters and are making good money with newsletters. And we're going to be talking about the ins and outs and the details of how to set up a newsletter business. Okay. So having said that, what types of niches can you do AI newsletters about? Well, the main one that I see a lot of is just basic AI news and information, news, information, resources, tools, things like that, right? That's gonna be your most common newsletter and that's also the broadest market that you can reach. But you might consider going a little more targeted and niching down to a more lucrative market. Maybe it's an AI newsletter for the legal field. Maybe it's an AI newsletter for the financial world. Uh, maybe it's different ways you can use AI in the medical field, you know, targeting some of these higher dollar markets. Uh, maybe it's for consulting. Maybe it's an AI newsletter for CEOs, like to get the CEOs really knowledgeable about the tools that they can use in their company that can provide uh, higher productivity, more efficiency, things like that, right? So there's a lot of different things you can do with a newsletter and a lot of different markets that you can target with the newsletter. And the interesting thing about it is the more targeted the market, the easier it is to reach those people that are potential subscribers. And by the way, the more targeted the market 
and the more niche the market, the easier it is to find those people online and the more likely they are to subscribe to your newsletter because it's just for them. It's perfect for them, right? So those are a few tips when it comes to creating a newsletter and being successful with the newsletter. The other thing you want to do is you want to be consistent with gathering the news and information and resources for your newsletter. Now, I happen to hire somebody, a virtual assistant, that does that for me, and therefore I'm constantly being fed all the latest news and information about AI. But you can do this with AI tools. You can probably create your own GPT if you wanted to that feeds you the latest information. Or you can set up Google Alerts or things like that. But the bottom line is I have a virtual assistant because it's so much more helpful to get the specific things that I want by having a human reviewed person that's actually doing the, the work, the research work and all that. So the newsletter though, I can't stress enough how lucrative the newsletter business is. You might think, well, okay, if I set up an AI newsletter, you know, I'll make some subscription revenue and so on like that. But there's so much more to a newsletter business because when you have that big of a captive audience, let's say you have even just a small audience, like a thousand subscribers to your newsletter, but it's a very niche audience. It's a very targeted audience. Guess what? Lots of people want access to that niche targeted audience. So you can actually sell advertising to those people and selling advertising in a newsletter is a very lucrative way to make an income. Another thing you can do is you can mention products in your newsletter, software, AI tools that have an affiliate program. And so you can make affiliate income from your newsletter as well, right? If you have your own products or services, if you have your own courses, your own software, or you partner with somebody who has it, right? You can make money that way. Some newsletters even have Google ads inside the newsletters. Now, I don't think that's the best way to monetize that traffic, but it's a way to monetize that traffic. The point I want to make about a newsletter is when you build a list of a targeted audience, a targeted group, that list is super, super valuable because when you have that captive audience, there's so much you can do with that audience. So many different ways you can monetize it. You can send your tribe to different things, different offers, different things that monetize. And that is a lot of power. And therefore, it's a very e easy business to sell because of all that power. You know, people want to buy audiences. They can buy a newsletter that has a built-in audience that's already been cultivated and nurtured and warmed up. So there is a lot of money to be made in newsletters. And if you decide to build an AI newsletter, Think about and consider niching it down to a very specific target market because that way you're going to get the results much faster. So I hope you like this video in our continuing series on ways to make money with AI with regard to content and information. On the next video, I'm going to talk about online courses, one of my favorite ways to make money and how I make money with AI in a whole bunch of different ways. Thanks for joining me. We'll see you next time on Making Money with AI.